founded in 2017 and focuses solely on electric vehicles. In the past few years alone, the company has gotten into a number of troubles under investigation following its merger with Hennessy Capital Acquisition Corporation 4 and was sued by the shareholders themselves. Canoe also faced financial problems and was questioned about its ability to continue operating. A special electric vehicle ordered by NASA with Startup Canoe is being tested at Kennedy Space Center, Florida. In April, the electric vehicle startup won a contract to supply the U.S. National Aeronautics and Space Administration with a crew transport vehicle for the Artemis Lunar Exploration Program. Images shared on the social media site show some of the first canoes being tested. NASA requires a zero-emission vehicle and emphasizes that the vehicle needs to carry four astronauts in full protective gear, three additional staff members, and a driver. The car also needs enough room for five equipment bags, four coolers, and another specialized bag. The model that Canoe supplied to NASA was a custom version of the lifestyle model, a quirky minivan that started production this year. The vehicle, originally developed for both private and corporate customers, is expected to be delivered before the end of this year or early 2023. Canoe will deliver the special versions to NASA in June 2023. With the lifestyle model, Canoe plans to sell four versions, standard, premium, adventure, and delivery. Prices start at $34,800 US dollars. The car is equipped with an electric motor with a capacity of 300 horsepower and 450 newton meters of torque. Canoe's next big order from Zeba Company after Walmart's order. Canoe has received another large order for its electric vehicles, following an order from Walmart announced in July of this year. Electric vehicle startup Canoe announced that Zeba, a growing car rental service provider, has agreed to buy 5,450 Canoe electric vehicles, with an initial commitment of 3,000 units to be delivered through 2020. 2024, Zebo will purchase lifestyle delivery vehicle and lifestyle vehicle for their long-term rental portfolio. Earlier this year, Walmart placed an order for 4,500 LDVs with the ability to purchase up to 10,000 more. Zeba identifies itself as a provider of flexible and affordable fleet solutions for small and medium-sized businesses (SMBs). The Zeba company chose the canoe because the design of the LDV and LV allows it to offer customer-specific configurations that can suit different use cases over the vehicle's life cycle. Zeba estimates that the LDV and LV models will be used by customers in last-mile delivery, ride-hailing, food delivery, and more. The order is part of Zeba's plan to achieve at least 50% electrification of its fleet by the first quarter of 2024. Canoe CEO Tony Aquila added that the company has a number of large orders and is finalizing multi-year allocations for customer deliveries by 2023. He also said that Canoe will share its production plan with the wider market in short time. The Canoe is a U.S.-made Class 1 commercial electric vehicle built on the company's proprietary multi-platform MPP, architecture that integrates all the critical components. The Lifestyle Vehicle LV, and Lifestyle Delivery Vehicle LDV, feature panoramic front windows for improved visibility and steer-by-wire technology. Both the LV and LDV electric vehicles are equipped with an 80 kilowatt hour battery that provides an estimated range of 402 kilometers. The LDV tram has a payload capacity of 120 cubic feet, 3.4 cubic meters, and one or two seats up front, while the LV has configuration options with five or seven seats.